Hello everybody, it's Tracy. Okay, I have some Christmas cards to share with you today. Yesterday, I had a nice crafty day at home and so I worked on some cards. And so these are really like my first cards of the year. I think I made one other <clears throat> a few weeks ago. But I am officially started on my Christmas cards. So, I chose to um, use my Magnolia stamps yesterday. So, I made three cards. And, okay. So, first of all, <clears throat> this first card, I used this paper. And this is new. Whoops. It's called Winter Wonderland. And these are with the papers look like and it's by recollections got that at Michael's a few weeks ago really cute um, I didn't hold, use a whole lot of the paper but I did use that paper and I use snowy tilde and this is my card <clears throat> now this is a A7 card and it's 5 by 7 inches <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. So it's a little bigger. And what I did is I have the designer paper in the back. And then for this piece here, I distressed the sky. I used, used distress ink, um, broken china for the sky. And then I stamped these trees in the back. Um, and that, for that, I used Winter Forest by Magnolia. And that's the name of the stamp. And it looks like this. It's pretty cool. Let me show you. This is the stamp. Isn't that cool? Love it. And so I stamped the trees in the back. And then I used snow text on it. Oh, I love snow text. Anybody looking for good snow? This stuff is so good. I mean, it just really works. In fact, let me open it so you can see what it looks like inside. Look at that. And you just scoop it up with a brush or toothpick, whatever. And put it on your stuff. And it works. And it just gets hard. And it doesn't take forever to dry either. About two hours, maybe. Well, I had my stuff kind of near a heater, so it was quicker. Alright, and so, like I said, oh, first I colored it, colored the trees, and then I used the snow text on the trees. Then, I just cut out some more trees with my doohickey dye, my magnolia. And this is called spruce. Cool dye. And then I have tilde here that I colored. I just used a ribbon. Ticket Punch, and this came from an Amy R. stamp set, The Sentiment. And that is it. I used some stickles on her snowflake. And with the snow text, I did use um, some Martha Stewart fine glitter. Okay? So that's that card. And that's paper from the collection to write on. Okay? So now, the second card I used, some older paper that I bought last year. And this is called Holiday Wishes, 6x6 pad. And that was from last Christmas. And the little girl I use is Tilda with Christmas Hearts. And here she is. And this is a regular A2 size card. Just layered the paper, cut out snowflakes with, um, I used Spellbinders dies, I used Martha Stewart punches for different kinds of snowflakes, uh, just colored Tilda up, cut her out with a Spellbinders die. And then right here, Warm Winter Wishes, the sentiment came from an Amy R. stamp set, and I just cut it out with a Martha Stewart heart punch after I had stamped it. So this is a simple one, but really cute. I love her. Look at her little red hair. I love her hair. <laughs> and then that's the inside with plenty of room to write. Well, not plenty, but enough. <laughs> I can stab a sentiment if I want. Okay, so now the last a card, I used Snowy, to, Snowy Hug. 
by Magnolia and I use this paper from last year called Jolly Holiday and this is a card this is a five and a half by five and a half square card and look at all of the snow I love it and see how it, it's just hard love it okay so for the back I used another Magnolia stamp and it's called Winter Day Background. That's what it looks like. Okay. And so I colored that up, added the snow text, then I have some of the uh, die cuts, the little spruce tree die cuts here that I added uh, frosted lace stickles. Then here I made the sto the snow drifts. Just I'm um, freehanded it and used my um, Zyron. So I ran it through my Zyron and then I added fine glitter. And this is the glitter I used. I love this stuff. Fine crystal fine glitter by Martha Stewart. Okay, and of course colored Tilda and her snowman with Copics added lots of snow text to their fur and bunches of snow and then right here um, this came from a CC Designs the sentiment CC design stamp set and I just cut it with my Stampin' Up I think it's called Modern Label Punch I'm not sure but it's a Stampin' Up Punch and that's it Oh, and I also did, if you see any glimmer, sparkle, shimmer, <laughs> it's because when the snow tech was wet, I did sprinkle the uh, fine glitter on it so that I could get some shimmer. And I actually really only used one piece of paper from that um, collection, and that was for the background. Oh, two pieces, because inside... Now that card has plenty of room to write on. Okay, so those are my cards. Yay! So hopefully today I'll be able to make a few more with some different stamps. <laughs> I think I'm going to do CC Design stamps today. I don't know. But anyway, I think I got a pretty good start on my Christmas cards. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day. Bye-bye.